dear students today we will see the topic the evolving role of software so software industry is in crisis see here the diagram failure of the uh, software is 31% success is 16% percent and over budget is 53% so because of this our softwares are always in crisis this is the sorry state of the software engineering today because uh, our software projects completed late successful is only 24 28% and cancels are 23% okay and uh, completed late over budget and or with feature missing 49% means the requirement which are uh, which we will get from the customer is not implemented fully okay so as per the ibm report 31% of the project get cancelled before they are completed 53% overrun their cost estimates by an average of 189% and for every 100 projects there are 94 restart so this is the uh, situation of the software projects see here the hardware cost is uh, reducing okay so managers and technical persons are asked why does it take so long to get the program finished uh, why are cost so high why cannot we find all errors before release why do we have difficulty in measuring progress of software development so factors contributing to the software crisis is large problems lack of adequate training in software uh, engineering increasing skill shortage and low productivity improvements okay so these are the some software failures first is rn5 it took the european space agency 10 years and dollars 7 billion to produce the arian 5 but this uh, uh, a, a giant rocket capable of hurling a pair of three ton satellites into orbit with h the rocket was destroyed after the 39 seconds of its launch at an altitude of two and a half miles along with its payload second software failure is when the guidance system's own computer tried to convert the one piece of data the data uh, from 64 bit is converted into 16 bit format and the number was too big and overflow error is occurred in this uh, then y2k problem this is the most famous problems uh, problem occurred in the world uh, in 2000 because uh, it is because of the ignorance about the adequacy or otherwise of using only the last two di digits of the year because after 1999 uh, the year comes that is 2000 so 19 in most of the cases the first 19 is ignored by the uh, by all the people because of this y2k problem is occurred okay so uh, some of the financial software uh, many companies have experienced failures in their accounting system due to faults in the software itself so this failure may range from producing the wrong information or to the whole system crashing so no silver bullet the hardware cost continues to decline dr uh, drastically the hardware cost is reducing day by day day by day but uh, for the software there is no silver bullet uh, however there are disparate cries for a silver bullet something to make the software cost drop rapidly as the computer hardware cost do but as we look to the horizon of a decade we see no silver bullet there is no single development either in the technology or the planning of the management and the management technique so because of that uh, we can say that there is no silver bullet for the software development so the hard part for building the software is uh, first gather the requirements then uh, design that requirement then code that requirement and then test that requirement okay so uh, we will still make the syntax error because we are human being always mistakes are done by the human being uh, and uh, we can make the conceptual errors also so it is that is the hard part for the software development so the blame for software bugs belongs to software companies, software developers, 
legal systems and universities so this is the evolving role of software as software is not having any silver bullet